Hey YouTube Divas and Debos, it's your girl Natasha Simone 187 coming to you today to show you my winter coat. Listen, this week in New York is gotten so cold, so windy. Last week we were enjoying 60s and now it's down in the 30s. So it is now time to bust out the heavy artillery, our winter coats. So Sit back, relax, watch me do my thing, 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 and showing you all the winter coats that I have to offer. Now, let me tell y'all something. I got a lot of winter coats, but we're going to get into that. Don't forget to subscribe if you are just new to my channel. If you are, hello, don't forget to subscribe. If you already are a subscriber, definitely thank you, thank you, thank you. Share, tell a friend, tell a friend, tell a friend. Don't forget to hit the notification button so you can be alerted every time I upload a video. And let's get this winter coat haul started. Now, my first winter coat is this cute little caramel or camel old navy wool coat. Now, this will be considered more like a car coat. I wouldn't wear this in the dead of winter, but I can definitely wear this now with a nice chunky scarf and a cute hat and some gloves. It is pretty warm. It reaches mid-thigh, two side pockets, and a nice little lapel single button and this size is an extra large um i absolutely love this coat i have something similar from women's within a longer version i'm going to show you right after this but this coat you could dress up dress down dress it all the way around i love a wool coat so you want to see a lot of wool coats in different colors um because i absolutely love a wool coat like i'm not sure if anyone is allergic um, but I love a wool coat. I used to hate wool coats, especially when it gets wet. They smell like a wet dog, but I absolutely love wool coats. So let me show you the next jacket. Okay, so this coat is from Women's Within. This one is a lot longer. It hits me mid-calf. I am 5'8", okay? This hits me mid-calf. So if you're shorter than me, it's probably going to hit your ankle or maybe drag on your feet. You got to be careful with this coat when you're shorter because I remember times when I was sitting down and I had to make sure to pull my coat up because I had stepped on this jacket more than once. Thank God I have never fell, but you do have to be careful. Two pockets, just like the Old Navy. This one is from Women's Within. I got this one last year. It has a few, a few more buttons. It has four buttons inside on the outside super cute and it's pretty doggone warm now i wore this with a big chunky scarf and even i have a, a fur collar cream that i wear with this it's really nice you got to be careful with the white of course because if you are a person like me that wear a lot of makeup be careful with this type of um, scarf but it's really nice very comfortable this is a size 18 i love the arms on it as well um i also have it in black same length same um brand from women's within same size i do one Okay, guys, so this is now the black one from Women's Within. Same size, same length, hits me mid-calf. Um, um, same amount of buttons, comes with four buttons. And I can honestly say with this one, I had the most trouble with because the buttons were full off, so I always have to bring it to the cleaners to get the buttons back on, or I would sew it on myself. But I love this jacket. A con, though. I want to be very transparent. I did not roll a brush this coat. Because if you own a pet, the fuzz on this coat is ridiculous. I don't get it so much 
for the camel color but the black one it shows up everything i have a little long hair chihuahua and every day that i wear this coat i have to roll a brush it so just make sure that you have a little bit of extra time to roll a brush a coat especially if you wear wool coats you already know this <laughs> black coats you already know this you have to roll a brush them so this is it and it's very comfortable so my next coat is a charcoal gray coat as you can see i got this one from ellos um ellos is i think a uk brand i bought this last year two years ago um i loved it because of the color it is a zip style, but it also has faux leather piping on the jacket, and it also has faux leather on the pockets. Two pockets, very deep pockets. Um, it is a zip closure, and it hugs the body really nicely. I think I also got this in a size 18. Has a little asymmetrical zip, great sleeves. Like I said, I'm 5'8", um, great sleeves. And it gives you a nice shape to the body. If you want, you can wear a cute little belt around this, but I just wore it as is. Um, not sure how much I pay for this coat. Honestly, my ex paid for it. I don't know how much it was, but I absolutely love this coat. Love it, love it, love it. Also, another wool coat. All right, my next coat is from Old Navy. I remember this coat. I got this at the end of last year. I probably paid 60 bucks for it, and I absolutely love it. I got a big, chunky gray scarf to go with this. I absolutely love it. I have a little <laughs> YSL pin that I put on the jacket. So this jacket has two button closures. It does have a little stretch to it. So if you have hips like me, you're going to love this jacket. Gives you a nice shape. Stand-up collar. Great sleeves. Hits right before the knees. It hit right before the knees. Um, I love this coat. It's a great coat. Hey. Hey. Um... <laughs> Very comfortable coat. Very comfortable, very warm coat. Like I said, I got it from Old Navy. This size, I wonder, what size is this? Let me tell y'all right now. It is a size 2X. This is a size 2X on this coat. And it also has a split in the back, but I kept it closed. I usually keep my splits closed. I don't know why, but I tend to do that. Unless the thread gets a little loose in the back, that's when I'll cut it. But typically, I leave... The splits closed on the back of these coats. Oh, Navy. Oh, it's from Ashy Stewart. I got this maybe two years ago. Um, short coat. I always wear these with like very tight jeans, leggings. Um, right now I have on some latex pants. Um, I always wear them with a little bit of a form fitting or a form fitted skirt because it um shows off my waist so nicely it's a very fitted coat so it looks really good with a very fitted pair of pants in my opinion so it is a size zip collar just like the black coat you have to roll a brush this coat because baby i'm out here looking like a cat lady even though i have a long hair dog so roll a brush these coats okay i just wanted to show you and be as transparent as possible um, these two have two side zippers that do work. They're not very deep, but you know, they cute on the boobs. My boobs are pretty big. So if it's really good on the boobs, this is a size 1820, um, in the jacket. Uh, I'm not quite sure if they sell this anymore, but Ashley Stewart have some really cute coats this year. So definitely check them out. Um, belted peplum. Sleeves are superb on this jacket. Sleeves are superb. Like, sleeves for me are huge. The reason why I think about sleeves is because of my sister. My sister is 5'11". 
anytime she tries on a jacket, she's always checking out the sleeves. And if she raises her hands, if her sleeves are too short, she ain't doing it, okay? So that's why I'm always a little adamant about sleeves. So, and especially the width of the sleeves is as being a plus size girl, a lot of times we'll fit a coat really nice, but the it's tight in the arms. All my jackets, I cannot stand a tight arm. So all my jackets are very comfortable in the arms. As she's through it, and I probably paid maybe 50, 60 bucks for this. Okay, 50, 60 bucks for this coat. And it's so cute. You could dress this up or down and you could wear it to church. It's so cute. I love this jacket. Okay, Ziva, so this next jacket is from Old Navy Bubble Jacket Cream. Now, I'm going to show you first. Sleeves are amazing. Sleeves are amazing. Okay, if you're a makeup girl, this jacket might not be for you, or you have to wear a scarf inside because, baby, I always mess up my jackets. Always. Because I wear makeup all the time. So, um, a lot of people, I know friends that stay away from cream jackets because of this. But I am not going to let a little makeup stop me from wearing cream. Okay? So, this is a cutie. It sits a little above the booty. Like right at mid booty. Two pockets, nice and deep. Very warm jacket. I wear this now until it probably starts to snow or get really, really cold. But it is really a warm jacket. This size of this jacket, let me tell you. Uh-oh. Now I don't want to come down. Now I'm trying to play itself in front of y'all girls and guys. Um, this size is a 2X as well. And it's lined. So that's why it stays so warm. Oh, Navy. And I know I probably paid very cheap for this jacket. Um, I'm a coupon junkie. I love it. I love it. <clears throat> so the next jacket I'm going to show you is from Fashion to Figure. I got this jacket last year. They still have this jacket on the website. Unfortunately, they came back out with the blue and the red. It's not in black. Um, this jacket is super cute. It's very long, but it has a beautiful shape to it. Hooded jacket. This size is a two. Let me put it on for you guys. It's long. So on me, it's mid-calf. I got my way out of the jacket. So I saw on Fashion to Figure, I left a comment under a picture of this jacket with me in it. And a lot of the ladies on there bought this jacket stating that the zipper malfunctioned. But I could clearly say I had this jacket for a year or more and I have no issues with the zipper so it has a cute detail in the waist as you can see two um, zipper pockets it's long it hugs the body really nicely very comfortable it also has these cool holes for your thumbs love this jacket now <clears throat> I was pairing this with a belt. I'm going to show you. So I know a lot of y'all out there on cancel Gucci. I cancel Gucci to a certain extent. Now, I did not sell any of my Gucci bags. I did not sell any of my Gucci, um, like even my sneakers or anything like that. I didn't sell my belt, but um, I won't buy any more Gucci, uh, whatever I have, I have. <clears throat> and I'm just showing that to you. I'm not trying to advertise for you to buy it. This is just how I was wearing my coat. And then Gucci, excuse my French, fucked up. And uh, a lot of people of color was not or and not buying Gucci anymore. A couple of our clients, we've had conversations about this too. I had a couple of clients sell their stuff. Um, a couple of clients that have their stuff and will no longer purchase from Gucci to each his own. Um, I'm at the not buying anymore. 
and that's it. But we're talking about coats. But I'm just want to be as transparent as possible with you guys. So this is from Fashion to Figure, size two, hooded. And it's very, very warm. I love this jacket. So if you want to get this jacket, they have it in blue and red. Definitely check out their website and go cop this jacket. Okay? I'm so New York. Cop this jacket. All right, guys. So my next jacket is, <clears throat> I wouldn't say on the expensive side. Everyone is different. For me, it's worth the price. The quality is amazing. I own two of these brand of coat. I'm going to show you the next reel. Um, this is a Rusak size 3X. Um, if you have not heard of a Rusak, definitely go look it up. But it's very close to a Makaj coat. They're cousins. Um, this coat color is green like a moss green my niece has the same one in black it has a cute leather tie for the waist i love these coats because let me tell you baby you get what you pay for these coats are very warm very warm i could wear a tank top in the dead of winter dead of january february and be hot okay hot um it has cute little details on the arm fur this is real fur around the hood now i caught a sale on this jacket this jacket was um three hundred dollars this jacket was 300 this is a size 3x um this jacket fit mid thigh it was a nice turn for you guys the arms are magnificent, and it has a really big hood. Very big hood. Rug sacks have a little detail on their shoulders of their coats, and I absolutely love this coat. Every time I wear this coat, I get a lot of compliments. This coat and the next coat I'm about to show you. I got this coat from a um, store called Deja Vu, but you can also go on um, rudstack.com. they also on Instagram. Check them out. All right, my next coat is also a Rudstack, just like the last coat. This one is all black. Very similar to my last coat, but it is shorter. Because the green one was about mid-thigh. This one is mid-booty cheeks. Double zip. So first zip. Second zip. Um, fur all the way down. Leather sleeves. My last one didn't have leather. Has the same de detail on the arm. Um, same fur hood. But this one, like the green one I didn't show you, it has um, cable knit sweater inside. This one doesn't. Nice hood. Um, two zips. Now the green one zips slanted. The, this one zips um, horizontal. Um, it's a warm jacket, y'all. This is one of my favorite jackets. I think I've only seen like two girls in the two years I've had this coat in New York City that had this jacket. Not to say that there's a whole bunch of, not a whole bunch of people in this jacket because I know there's mass production, but I haven't seen a lot of people in this jacket. This jacket was $700. I caught a discount. It was originally a thousand and I got it for 700. They do have layaway. Not sure about the website if they have layaway. But if you're ever in New York City, check out Deja Vu. This is where I got it. It's on 60th between 2nd and 3rd Avenue. Not too far from Bloomingdale's. Has a zip by the booty to give you a little more comfort. And I absolutely love this jacket. Very, very warm.
Now, my last jacket I'm going to show you guys is a jacket that I bought last year. I love this jacket. Now, if you've seen Coming to America, Lisa, okay? I love Lisa Sherling coat. And as a kid, I was like, I got to get one. But my mama wasn't spending no Sherling money back in those days, okay? So when I got grown and made my own money and could afford it, I bought one. But mine is not as long as Lisa's. This one is a short version of Lisa's coat. Very similar to Lisa's coat. So this is my Sherwin. Now, um, I got this from Daniel's Leather. If you are not familiar with Daniel's Leather, you can go on his Instagram, check out Daniel's Leather. Um, they have really great coats for men, women, and children. They have leather jackets, Sherlin furs, you name it, they got it. And if they ain't got it, they can make it for you, custom. So this one is not a custom jacket, but they made it specifically for my size. Um, this jacket fits mid-booty, two side pockets, also little buckle details, hood, fur hood, collar with two buckles for closure. I'm not going to close this coat up. I'm sorry, y'all. I'm already sweating in this coat, and I just had it on for a couple of minutes, not even a couple minutes. Um, I've only worn this coat one time. In New York, the winter has not been cold enough for me to wear this on a consistent basis. That's first. Second of all, sometimes I ride the train. Who is going on the train with the Sherlin? That's for two. And for three, it's just not for me an everyday coat. This is a cute coat, okay? This is not an everyday coat for me. Um, the last two coats, those are my everyday coats. This is a coat where, for me, I'm hanging out with my homegirls. Oh, I'm going out with boot thing. I got a cute little pair of boots to match these. Um, I'm not going to tell you how much I paid for this coat. This coat was um, a little bit on the expensive side. Nothing crazy, but a little expensive, um, but a great price for me. Um, this jacket, I absolutely love it. Um, like I said, I only wore it once. Um, and every When I wore it, I got a lot of compliments. Even to this day, my sister's like, yo, are you going to wear your coat? Um, if New York is cold enough, yeah. And if um, me and Boo Thing are together, because Boo Thing drives, and then I drive too, but I don't own a car right now. When you live in New York, <laughs> you don't really, not everybody has a car, okay? But I planned on getting a car this year, but when COVID hit, it was like, what's the point? I was going to buy it for my birthday. That was going to be a birthday gift to me. But I guess I'll be buying it next year, depending on how, COVID is for next year. Hmm. So, um, yeah. So this is my Sherlin coat, and I absolutely love it. I gotta take it off, guys, because it is so hot. Very, very hot coat. Um, very, very heavy. This is a heavy jacket. So if you own Sherlin's, it's very, very heavy. Um, and the detailing is amazing. Okay. I, I usually keep this in a um a zip up um, cloth bag, put it in my closet. Um, you can treat it just like a fur and put it in a vault if you want, like in the refrigerator vault. You could definitely do that too, because it is fur. And yes, so um, this was only half of the jackets that I showed you guys, because we would have been here all night. I have a serious shopping problem. I love fashion i love coats i love shoes i love handbags i love clothing i love hair um i'm just a super girly girl and you will get to see that more and more often as you watch my videos um i'm going to make another video with the remainder coats that i have i do have some down coats and i think i have some more wool coats maybe like one or two wool coats that i love to show you guys um just that time is not allowing me. And we'll be here all night. Y'all got things to do, okay? So, guys, don't forget to subscribe. Um, tell a friend, tell a family member, share my video. Hit the notification button so you'll be alerted every time I upload a video. 
guys, please be safe. Been watching the news. COVID is rising, especially in 49 U.S. states. Um, we got to do better, guys. We, we do. And I just don't know um, what the answer is. But I'm just going to go by what the doctors say. And that is wash your hands, social distance, wear your mask. We're coming up into the holiday season. Um, let's get COVID under control. Please don't bounce from house to house to house. Get tested before the holidays. Wear your mask during it. Please be safe. Stay blessed. And I'll see you guys soon. Night. <laughs>